Hi guys, this is Megan with the blog WilsonHumpster.com and today I'm going to do the 2021 unboxing of the Amazon Baby Registry Welcome Box. So on Amazon, there's a really easy way to create a baby registry. We are currently pregnant with baby number three and I got a welcome box for my second baby as well and it was just really fun to see what was inside and there was actually some things we used quite a bit so I was really excited to see what they had. This year, I think they changed up every single year, so I'm curious to see what they have. I did create a registry for this baby, even though we only need a few things. There's a few things you have to do to actually get the box. You can't just create a registry. So I think you have to create a registry first off. You have to put, you have to check off each category box. So in the registry checklist, you don't have to have every single one of those things in your registry. Although if you put one of those things in your registry, it will check it off for you but you can manually go through and check each box and you just want all those boxes checked off basically. You also have to purchase $10 of items through your, through your baby registry. So you can even just put something in there that you're going to order anyway and then order it through the registry and that will count that as ordering $10 through the registry. Oh, and then I forgot the first thing is that you have to be an Amazon Prime member. So if you just have a regular Amazon account and you're not Prime, then this won't work. So you have to be a Prime member, you have to check off all the checklist boxes and you have to purchase $10 off the registry and then they will send you a free Amazon baby, baby registry welcome box. So what will happen is they will actually put whatever this box costs that they will credit that amount to your account so you can go through the whole process of you have to claim the box and then they'll put it in your shopping cart and then as you go through the checkout you can use that amount that they gave you towards the baby registry box to purchase it and then the shipping is free. So. That is how you get the box because it can be a little confusing because it might not seem like it's free at first because you're using a credit and they're not just automatically sending it to you, but it is free. Don't worry. It's just, that's just how you have to do it. So I have a video from when I got pregnant with my son. I probably did that one in 2019 and this is the 21, 2021 box. So I wanted to show you guys what was different because I know a lot of you really enjoyed that video. So let's just get right into this unboxing. So this is already different than the other year. Um, when I got this before, it was in a box, in a shipping box, and then the Amazon baby registry box was inside of that, and it was kind of, I think it had polka dots or something, but this one is actually a bag inside of the box. So that's a little bit different. So it has this little card on top from the Amazon baby registry, and then let's just pull this right out. Throw on the box inside. All right, let's see what we have in here. The so first thing on top, is an easy start anti-colic bottle and start pacifier. So let's open this up. It's a MAM bottle with a little pacifier inside. It's hand it is handy to have the bottle because when I when all of my glass bottles are dirty, my son is drinking water out of bottles right now, so it's kind of nice to have extra bottles around for before they can drink out of sippy cups. And this is a three-piece set of hat, gloves, and socks. So it's kind of like a pink, peachy pink color. There's some little gloves for the baby from keeping themselves from scratching their face, which I don't generally use those. There's some little socks. So extra socks are always handy, let me tell you. So these will probably really come in handy. And then a little hat. And I just, I do really like this pink color. It's not super pink pink. It's just kind of like a, a coral pink. I don't know how to explain it. Like a dusty pink, that's what I'm trying to think of. So if we do have a girl, I would probably really use this. Then we have seventh generation diaper. I think it's one diaper. Yep, just a sample pack of one diaper for eight to 14 pounds. I probably won't use that because we do cloth diaper. Okay, one a day women's prenatal vitamins before, during, after pregnancy. So I guess that's just a sample of prenatal vitamins. Then we've got a aquaphor sample and a Mommy's Bliss Ripe Water coupon. Here's a little pack of water wipes. This actually would probably come in handy because sometimes I forget to pack cloth wipes into the diaper bag, so I like having these little tiny sample packs of wipes in the diaper bag for if I forget enough cloth wipes. So this will actually be really good because we are just, we are out of, I think we have like one wipe left in that little tiny pack of disposable 
wipes in our diaper bag. Here's another anti-colic bottle. This one I think we also got in the last box. Oops. Yep, this looks exactly like the other one we got in the last box. It's a Dr. Brown's anti-colic bottle, which again, for having extra bottles around, I definitely prefer this one over this one. They just seem to like it better for drinking water or stuff out of. And I do breastfeed, so I obviously won't need those for a long time, but for my toddler or my other baby, just for like extra things for drinking out of. Okay, and then these are the last two things in the bottom of the bag. One is an Avino baby wash and shampoo, and then this one is a Cetaphil baby wash and shampoo. So these ones I definitely won't use because I make my own homemade baby shampoo and, and wash and stuff. And then that is all of the stuff in the bag. So if you were curious what they're sending along in the Amazon welcome boxes now, which I guess they're actually bags now, those are all the things that I got in mind. And some of this stuff will come in handy. The majority of the stuff I won't use just because of I already have a lot of baby stuff and any of the like shampoo and stuff I make myself. I don't use Aquaphor and I have you know, prenatal vitamins. But it was really nice of them to send me this box and I, I had a lot of fun seeing what was inside of here. And I do really like this little hat and sock set. It's just kind of a pretty pink color. Last time they sent along a onesie, which it was actually a really cute onesie and I really loved it. So I was hoping I would get one in this set, but I guess they're doing the hat and gloves and socks this time which is also really cute. So I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what was in this Amazon box. And if you guys decide to get one yourselves, just follow the steps that I gave in the intro and you will be able to have one of these sent to you as well. But thank you guys for watching this video and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.